Naomi, I can't believe this day is finally here. It seems like just yesterday, I finally got the courage to talk to you while we were at 4-H. What better pickup line than, hey, can I clean your goat pen? <laughs> Wasn't the best, but it got the job done, and here we are today. I don't have a notepad, I don't have whatever. People's like, what you gonna say in your best man's speech? All this stuff, I'm like, I'm going from the heart. Like, that's the only way to do it. Half of my life, Naomi has been my sister. I'm emotional, I'll just bring that up. For the past 10, 15 years, like, it's been Gregory and Naomi. Dear Gregory, I can't believe our wedding day is finally here. Of course I procrastinated and wrote this note at the last minute, hence the paper. But I can't think of a more perfect representation of our relationship. It's nothing fancy, just two people who love each other unconditionally. Our relationship is truly something special and something that will last forever. After all these years, the only thing I've been sure of is that I love you and you love me. We always used to talk about this day when we were young and it's finally here and it's a dream come true. I am so grateful for you and all you have done for me. You have helped me get through some of the toughest times in my life and I can't ever thank you enough for that. We are so excited for Naomi and Gregory's future together. They have always weathered every storm together. For that to be said for the past 10 years and them pull through all of that together, you truly know that they are best friends and they are meant to be together. Yeah, here. Are you gonna cry? No. <laughs> I can't believe that you offering to clean my goat pen 10 years ago would lead us to where we are today. In fact, that day, I thought you just felt bad for me because Lydia sliced her finger and had to leave the fairgrounds, which meant I was left cleaning all four of our pens. It's almost like you knew my love language is acts of service. Forming photographs alone. Seems like just yesterday, I finally got the courage to talk to you while we were at 4-H. From that moment until now, we have been through so much together that has helped build our relationship to where it is today. I know that we were truly meant to be. It hasn't always been easy, but I know that nothing comes more naturally to me than loving you. It has been an honor being able to love you for so many years. We have been through ups and downs, but we always come out stronger in the end. You are so kind, caring, and so funny. Your smile can light up a room. You never fail to make me laugh, and always remind me not to take life so seriously. Most importantly, I promise to always let you get your naps in. <laughs> Naomi, this is the happiest day of my life, and I can't wait to spend the rest of my life with you. I love you so much. Let's do this. We all knew Naomi by her sweet smile and kind heart, but the Warner family turned out to truly get to know her when Gregory had decided to make her his in just 10th grade. Never forget that I love you. If I could give you one thing in life, 
I would give you the ability to see yourself through my eyes. Only then you would realize how special you are to me. Love, Dad. In my opinion, the best thing you can do is find a person who loves you for exactly what you are. Good mood, bad mood, Greg when you wake Naomi up from a nap. Ugly, pretty, handsome, what have you. The right person is still going to think the sun shines out of your ass. I know you guys will continue to flourish in your relationship and wherever life takes you. Just remember, we love you, we're here for you, and we can't wait to see where life takes you.